Welcome back to the morning wrap. It is a season of giving and did you know there are pets in two out of three American households, but unfortunately one in 10 households live under the poverty line, making it really tough for some to properly take care of their pets. This is why the Michelson found animals foundation launched the better neighborhood project to help out people regardless of their socioeconomic status. So here to tell us more about this is the CEO himself. Brett Yates, thank you so much for being here. Thanks for having me today. I love this. I think this is so great. Um, I know the holidays are coming up too, so I feel like a lot yeah. of people might need some help. So let's first just start off with why this was so important for you to launch. So we had the idea before COVID hit, and we wanted to make sure that we were doing what we can in LA to help the communities that most need it. And uh, so we set this up, and then COVID hit, and we realized that even more so now, those communities need it. So our first event, we were in Boyle Heights and we were nervous about getting out of the doors and mm -hmm. coming outside. And uh, we were, got a call from the YMCA and they said, the need is greater than the fear, so please come. And ever since that day, we've been providing services in those communities. So what has the response from the community been like? Oh, it's amazing. Yeah. You know, we serve 500 to 700 families in, in any of these events. We also do pet pantries on a weekly basis and it's so much needed. It's, it's fantastic that we get to serve these communities. And you see the joy in the kids' faces. Mm -hmm. It's just wonderful. Oh, and the little pups' faces too. Look oh, at yeah. that. Um, let's talk about the holidays because I feel like we've hit this point in society right now where we have gas prices that are up, inflation's crazy, um, rent increases, I keep on hearing about that too. So that's putting a lot of people in positions that they might not have ever thought that they would be in. Yeah. Um, so I'm assuming you might have a lot of people looking for other ways to get help through the holidays when it comes to their pets. For sure. So at these events, we provide uh, food for families. We provide collars and leashes, spay neuter services. We do um, vaccines and dental checks for animals. So there's all kinds of services that we provide. And it's not just Michelson Fun Animals. It's all the partners that we work with in community. Mm -hmm. And even more so, some of the elected officials help us to get the word out and spread the word and get people at the events. That's really what allows us to have 500 to 700 families served. So it's, That's a lot. Yeah, it is. That is a lot. Okay, so you have an event coming up. We do. December 9th, we're going to be working with the Chargers, and it'll be at Morningside Fun. High School. Yeah. That's great. They're great partners. So at Morningside High School, it'll be from 9 to 1, mm -hmm. and we have uh, a host of people that'll be out there with us, and it should be fantastic. Do they have to sign up in advance, or? Okay, so how does that so work? Some of the services they can sign up for in advance, so spay, neuter, um, some of the vaccines, those kind of things are sign up in advance. Mm -hmm. You can go to our website at michelsonfoundanimals.org and you can sign up there. Some of the other goods that we provide, so the foods, the collars, the leashes, you don't have to sign up for. So there's kind of two tracks in these events. Uh, the goods services or the goods people can come without signing up. Okay, so what's the one thing that you want people to know, not only about the organization, but about getting help? I, I feel like a lot of people sometimes might hesitate or be a little shy to try to admit that they might need some extra assistance. So it's the thing that we've been doing this now for three years and I love the fact that people have lost that now. People will show up for these events and they, they just know that they need help with their pets mm -hmm. and we're there to do that. And so many of our partners that I could spend hours naming um, have been fantastic about this too. When we have people line up and, and get in line and talk through this, they, they're not ashamed of it. Um, and, you know, the first few weeks, it was, uh, people were nervous about mm -hmm. it. And at this point, people are just happy to have a community and to have people serving. This is so, great. Yeah, Thank you so much for being here. This is amazing. Um, let everyone know where they can find you and get more information. So Michelson Found Animals is at michelsonfoundanimals.org. And we also have Michelson Philanthropies, where we have other foundations that we serve. So either of those, michelsonphilanthropies.org and you'll be able to see more about us. This is great. Thank you so much for being here. I really I appreciate, appreciate it. it. I feel like it's perfect timing too with the holidays coming up as really well. Is. You're the best, great organization, Thank and I you. love that you guys are giving back the way you are. Um, we're going to put all this information too up on our website at kcounties.com slash the morning wrap. 